I don't know if that's the only view we're gonna get, but not much. Can see some stuff though. So. Anyway, it should be just under a tenth of a mile. Ready to you, Mount Hale. Mount Hale. What? Four and a half miles of goodness. Well, so far so boring. Yeah, a little mud going on here. So, not much to see. Yeah, rocks. Yeah. We're remnants of the fire tower. Mount Hale. So, what? Four and a half miles of goodness. Baby. It's uh, windy at the bottom, so it's probably going to be windy at the top. Mm -hmm. It's also kind of another reason we came here. Because everything else is going to be too windy. 2.2 up. 2.2. I guess I was wrong. It's even less than four and a half. All right, three hours or less. Let's go. Well, after a brief 400-foot warm-up, here we go. Pretty much up for two miles. Consistent gradient, just like this. Legs are a little sore from yesterday, but a little. Yeah, but mine fall into the class of a little. Mine are a lot. <laughs> Andrew's legs are very sore. <sighs> Happens. Particularly after not hiking for like four months. <sighs> not in a hurry though. Well, so far so boring. Much muddier. Tonight. Yeah, a little bit of mud going on here. Yeah, there were probably some showers that passed through overnight. Yeah, I think so. I can't believe it rained overnight. Yeah. They weren't expecting too much rain today, no. if any, but. I should rain today, realistically. No, it's just. Except maybe up in the elevation. Overcast, but. Yeah, the, I don't recall seeing too many notable things about this hike. No. I know there's no view at the summit. No. But there's a big rock climb. Like, yeah. There's a big ass stick, I think, like on the summit. And then one of those carns slash cairns that's of monstrous size. But other than that, I don't really think we're going to expect too much today. a good way to look at it. Expect nothing, never be disappointed. Advice from Andrew. Pretty steadily uphill. Some changes in the gradient every now and then. But regardless, not a whole lot going on. I feel like people go over here. Oh uh, yeah, there's some falls over there. Yeah. Down there. You can kind of sort of see that running water. I'm sure if you get down there it's more impressive. But, yeah. On a hike where there's not a whole lot of notable stuff, I guess. That's one thing. Possibly the most interesting thing so far today. Go you know, stream crossing. Not thinking this is going to be terribly challenging. Just don't go plummeting down. We'll try this way. This way looks fun. 
Yep. About as fun as you can get. Smooth. Well, on this little ridge thing, about 2,800 feet right now. It's been uh, still very steady uphill. No warm up walk in for this hike, you just kind of go. But uh, really, not that steep either. Nothing too crazy. But, either way, happy to get two days of hiking in anytime I can. <sighs> oh. I actually feel a lot better than I did yesterday. With my lungs, anyway. I can breathe. Which is much uh, more conducive to hiking and uh, living. Well, gradient's increasing a little bit. Rocks are wet. Got this little stream, spring, runoff, whatever the hell. About to get into these, uh, it's like three little switchbacks. And they're going to be pretty steep. Coming up the next half a mile or so. No matter. Should be fun. Maybe. Ooh. Well, that looks wet. I hope I don't fall and smash my face. And like, seriously though. I did it, and I didn't even die. You slept the minute you said you did it. I know. But I still didn't die. Yet? Yet. Yeah. Well, through the switchbacks, we got a half mile to go on, until we're there. It shouldn't get too much steeper than this. A couple spots maybe. But overall, not too bad. Andrew said this is Slide Mountain-esque, which I kind of agree with. Yeah, not a whole lot going on. It's actually even shorter distance. Yeah. This is true. Some maps say 1.9, some say 2.2, 2.3. I've seen it all. Nobody can really go down to the last 10. The heated debate will continue for centuries. Well, less than a quarter mile to go. So, pretty consistent, pretty boring. Probably not going to be a whole lot at the top, but we're almost there, so that's nice. Well, I don't know if that's the only view we're going to get, but not much. You can see some stuff though, so anyway. Be just under a tenth of a mile. So we get to Mount Hale. We are approaching what looks like a summity area. I'm gonna guess this is it. We are shrouded in clouds with no views thus far. Don't think that's going to change. There's an enormous rock pile. And Andrew, we're here. We made it. Cool, 
Karn. Uh, 2.3? Uh, I don't think so, but everything says something different. Break time. Well, there was not much to see here. Besides the rocks. Yeah, rocks. There's a couple things over there. Yeah. Or remnants of a fire tower. So it's really trying hard, but <laughs> we all try and sometimes fail. That's what the sun is doing, so we're leaving. Kind of chilly and windy. So this is what I'm saying about all these distances. It's 2.3 here. The bottom says 2.2. Your she says 2.0 and 1.9. Yeah. It said both. So I've gotten everything except for 2.1. Nobody says 2.1. That's yeah. not in the play at all. No. So we know we, we know it's not that. It probably is that just because yeah. everybody's so wrong that the one thing that they're wrong about is right. I, I guess in a twisted sort of way I know what you're saying. But yeah, we're gonna we're gonna head out. Thank you, Hale. You're not Hale enough somehow. No. Huh. No. That's definitely going to be a one on those views. Thoughts on hail? Probably one of the easiest ones we've done so far. Yeah, it, that very simple trail. Not doesn't take you long. I mean, we were tired from yesterday, like really tired, but we still managed to do it in like I don't know, like four hours. Not really a big deal. Yeah, yeah. I mean, it's really about the simple. Anywhere between four and four and a half miles. No one really seems to be. Nobody can sure. be quite sure of the mileage on this. Um, but I mean, yeah, it is pretty easy. I mean, views on the top are absolutely just zero from the yeah, summit. Yeah. But you know, give it a one. Non-existent. Are we, are we calling it a double one? Yeah, it's a double one. Yeah, we're calling it. A, yeah, so one. It's easy as hell, but one. It's not much of a reward when you get up there. So really nice for like a half day, though. I mean, yeah, it's pretty much just there for you to get exercise. Yeah, it's so. fun. Yeah, it's enough. <laughs> we'll take know. it. It's got a nice car up at the top. That was interesting. Yeah, yeah, you got that. And, and uh, it's not. It wasn't the worst summit ever. 
That, that's for sure. No, we, we've seen much worse. We, we've. I don't know if it cra quite cracks the top five of the worst summits. No, I don't think it on, would. But I think that was fine. Yeah. Plenty of space to top sit. Top ten maybe, but the top five. A couple of things no. to look at. Yeah. So at least there was an enormous, you know, rock pile. So it's fine. I had a fine time. That's that's fine. Yeah. All right, now to go drive five hours and uh, get back to Colton. All right.